Oh. My. God. No one told me there's fucking werewolves in the bloody game. Oh, what? what up, it's Cam, and welcome back to Alan Wig 2. This is chapter 3. Oh, I have not touched this game for like two days. I need to be doing this game because this game is amazing. So I'm going to try and everything on day and try and upload a chapter. So, so I'm just, I am in love with this game and I want to keep the momentum going because this game is amazing. So, um, okay, so he's found Alan Wick. He came from the dark place, which I really want to go to because I want, I want to know what the dark place is all about. You know, the dark place sounds great. You know, he came from the ocean, so maybe the dark place, maybe if I just walk out there, I might go into the dark place. No? Okay. Uh, okay, so I know I gotta look for evidence because the wolf's receded and I can't seem to find any. Um, evidence, evidence, evidence. It's a bunch of trees. Could that be evidence? No. Okay. Um. Hmm. I mean, it's just a bunch of broken trees. I'm not really finding any, any evidence. Oh. Wait, I may have found something. A creepy twig sculpture? I may have found... Oh, I think I found some evidence. I see a box. A washed up box. A locked box. Oh, it's got... Oh. Is that the cult of the tree symbol on it? Oh. That was Lots easy. Ammo. Ooh, flare. Looks like they're tools of the trade. Ammo. What's that? Rather like alcohol. Ooh. Upgrade. Oh, wait, 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 wait. The Remember they look like us, people. but they aren't. They're like animals, and it's our job to hunt them and get them. Okay. Is that everything that's in there? Okay, so what happens now if we go back to our room and we put this up? Nightingale goes missing for 13 years, shows up murdered, and then turns into a monster. After I stop Nightingale, a rider who's also been missing for 13 years turns up. Wait, maybe What's Adam Wake might turn into a monster? What kind of case is this? I mean, you never know. The other guy did. These stashes could contain clues about the cult. Better keep an eye out for more. Um. Makes sense. Okay. Do I put that there? No. That movie? Hmm. Um. There we go. Okay. Cool. I'm not missing anything else, right? No? Okay. I'm good. Okay, so I, is this the only evidence there is? I mean, it looks like... Okay, let's go back. Let's go back and tell our findings. Hmm. Wait, what's up here? Oh, hello. Another page. Okay. Hmm, wait, it's got up here for a second. There might be something up here, maybe. What's 
looks very... Oh, 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 yeah. All pages. Okay, so... This page is leading up to here. Game saved. What? Quick turn. Hello? So I'm back here now. Do I need to be back here? Oh. My. God. No one told me there's fucking werewolves in the bloody game. Oh, what? Bastard. Even the animals are turning into monsters. That actually scared the fuck out of me. I need a heart attack. That was not okay. Oh, what's this? Ammo. Oh wait, another page. Oh, there's an arrow. Pointing this way. Oh, <gasps> keys. Stem side keys, what? Wait, keys. Wait, keys to what? What were they for? Oh, stem side. Oh, up that way. Oh, that's oh, that's new. Oh, a whole new area. Should I not bring my partner with me? Like. For safety or something? Ah, the bridge. I'm gonna switch weapon actually. There's something written here. Who? A poem? Or a One real? bird of light. Two Reminds for darkness, the three Rhymes birds for a fight, four for a struggle, five birds for injury, six for misery, seven for ending, whatever it may be. Oh, I need to find items, do I? I have none. Okay. A little clothespin doll. Perfect weird souvenir for Logan. Oh, camera. Ah, so I can use this, can I? Nah. Oh. I don't know which one's the right way. Maybe in here it would tell me. Creepy dolls. Mysterious rhymes. No weirder than anything else going on, I guess. Okay. Oops. Um, 
Where does this go? Is that everything? Okay. I don't know that riddle, so we're going to leave it for now. Oops. This has got to the stem. Oh, nursery rhythm. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, what's that noise? Oh, I'm hearing some... We the car, Anderson. How's it going down there? I think I'm done here. I'll meet you at the parking lot. What's that noise? Okay, so before I invest that noise, I went to go and search everything. And I did find some stuff. Well, a lot of stuff, actually. Um, I found a lot of evidence stuff lying around. Um, just need to put them all together. There we go. I found a lot, I found all these dolls. I don't know what these dolls mean. I think I found them all. Unless I'm missing one. I must be missing one. But I did find some more documents. Oh. Um, wait, where does this go then? Okay, does that go there? No? There? No? There? Okay, maybe this goes on a different page. There we go. Oh, yeah, I found the stash as well. Uh, not much in there. I was kind of hoping for a lot of shit. And I found another loot box as well. There we go. So. Which page was it? This one. No. Oh, whatever, it's gone. Anyway, find all the evidence I can find. Hang on, wait a minute. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's another thing I'm forgetting to do. Is do these. Saga edged toward the broken door. Her gun ready. Flashlight aimed ahead. Nightingale said it would be here. The Cauldron Lake General Store was overgrown. Left to rot. Saga thought about the cult of the tree. They had been here. Waiting. Planning a gruesome ritual murder. Meanwhile, they played cards in the general store, like it was just another late-night poker game. Saga stepped closer to the door. Had the animal broken it? There was a loud crash. Saga found herself face to face with a cultist, a hulking figure in a raincoat. We watch in the night, wild eyes behind a plastic deer mask, an axe in his raised hand. Okay. He'd been on the trail of the writer forever. The writer he despised. Hemingway, Bukowski, Wake. I'll get you. I'll find you. I'll make you pay. You're in over your head. He descended into the tunnels, from the dark city, into the ocean of darkness. Next up, Caldera Street Station. Something, a presence, rumbled. Not a train. Shadows shifted on the platform. The writer's cult waited for him there. The cult of the word. A cultist leaned close. I carry his words close to my chest now. You're not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. He'd be caught. Murdered. They got him. They didn't get him. He was reborn out of hate. He was there. But he was risen. Sent to find the light switch up from the lake that was not the lake. Ah, huh. interesting. Okay, let's go and investigate this noise. I think it's coming from that... T yeah, it's coming from here. Oh. Are these guys dead? So they were here last time. They might be dead. Oh, I... Warning. Activity detected. A-W-E. Event in progress. Cauldron Lake. Oh. What's an A-W-E? Casey, 
What exactly does the FBC do? After New York, when I started looking for our friend here, their name came up. I pushed them for any files they had on him, but got stonewalled. They have a reputation of showing up for weird shit. They have a presence here, and now we find our writer. How about that? Hmm. It's a little bit spooky. Okay, let's go back to the car. So we need to go back to town for something. So let's go and do this. Hello, Casey. Ready to go? Doesn't he look like he looks a bit like John Wick? Don't know why. Just does. It's probably because of the suit, the hair, the beard, everything. Oh, it's dark. taking you back to our field office in Bright Falls. You can freshen up there, and then we'll talk properly. Hey mom, before you say anything, I'm totally fine. Don't freak out, dad shouldn't have even texted you. Logan? No one texted me. Mm. What's going on? I'm totally fine, I slipped, that's all. God, it's not the end of the world. Put your father on the phone. Um, okay. Dad, it's mom. Don't worry, hun. Logan slipped in the shower and bumped her head. She has a slight concussion, but I'm keeping an eye on her. Lucky I heard her fall. She could have drowned. Jesus, David. Why didn't you call? Oh. I tried. It didn't go through. She's fine. Oh, really? didn't Rose mention about my but daughter drowning? You? you sound stressed. No, it's uh, oh. just a weird case, that's all. Well, if you need a hint, my years of board game victories tell me Colonel Mustard did it. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep an eye out for him. <laughs> Love you, Dave. Love you too, honey. Wanna say bye to Logan? Just tell her I love her. Bye for now. So my daughter could have actually joined in the shower, like Rose said. I look pretty banged up. Casey looks fine though. Still got that model face going on. Me, not so much. Now on to John Wick. Is there anyone you'd like us to reach out to, Mr. Wake? You've been gone a long time. No. No. They'd be in danger. It'll come for me. Okay, let's talk about something else. <laughs> Robert Nightingale. Do you know him? You were both here in 2010. The Dark Presence got him back then. That's the last time I saw him. 13 years. Wait, so didn't the sheriff get taken as well? So isn't he. Tell us about the pages. Oh, the Shadow of Deputy. You isn't like he stuck in a dark place now? Return. Is this the name of the story on these pages? The writer's name has been scratched out pretty violently, but your name can still be made out underneath. <laughs> scratched out. Yeah. Scratch. Did you write these pages, Mr. Wake? I'm trying to remember it. It's it's a crazy jumble like a, like a nightmare. I, it doesn't... It doesn't make sense. What? Do you remember him? I remember. I remember. Oh, 
the dock this time. What the kill? So I'm awake now? Oh, I am. I'm Alan Wake. Oh, late night. Oh, fuck. I'm a dog show tonight. I'm John Wick. I have no memory of how I got there. It was out of control. I didn't need another mugshot in the fucking tabloids. Had I already done the show? Was that a recording? I like how they're actually using like real stuff now. be an exciting time for you tell me does it ever get old so does what get old publishing a new book are you okay there my friend you look like you've been cooped up in the writer's room for a few too many years <laughs> this is exactly how i feel <laughs> you know i waited so long to get my hands on the sequel to departure you left us on quite the cliffhanger We've all been dying to know what it's not a lake, it's an ocean really means. You and me both. Well, our wait is over. Your new book, Initiation, hits the shelves tomorrow. What? That's exactly what every reader will be asking. This book is mind-bending. It's so cerebral. I mean, how would you describe it? A an auto-fictional thought experiment? A, a, a horror story? A postmodern detective story? Wait. This isn't right. I, I haven't written anything. He's so humble. Okay, you got me. Good prank, very funny. But yeah, I sad to say, I, I, I've not written this. I, I'd remember if I'd written a book, right? Or maybe it was written by your evil double. <laughs> well played, man! That is spot on! Playing the role here! Pretending the world of the book overlaps our own? That's very meta indeed. You see, Initiation tells the story of a fictional writer named Alan Wake, who is trapped in a nightmare, desperately trying to find the manuscript of a novel he has forgotten he has written. The book is set in New York, but it might not be New York at all. He is tormented by his dark doppelganger, guided by visions of a fictional detective he has written. That's right. Alex Casey is in this book as well. Uh, oh, this is weird. I guess we'll just keep doing this the whole show. The joke's on me. But isn't that what you sign up for with auto fiction? No, but seriously, I found the the structure of the reality you build in the book fascinating. It reminded me of the Matrix. I mean, the writer is physically in his writer's room, trapped there, and he projects himself out to this dark dream of New York through the story he is writing. Uh, like astral projection. Did I get that right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Go on. I should be taking notes here. Uh, this is great stuff. Notes to that other Alan Wake in that room writing this as we speak? Are we all in your story, Alan? No, I, I, I wish you every success with your new book, Alan. I hope it's as successful as your best-selling Alex Casey series. Initiation hits the shelves tomorrow. After this, I'm sure we'll all be eagerly awaiting the culmination of this so... journey trilogy of yours. A book called 
I'm not real. Perhaps. Man, thank you for one of the strangest interviews of my entire career, Alan. Always talk of meta narratives. I'm expecting to disappear once this scene ends. What is happening? Oh. Everyone's gone. Hello? Everyone's left me. I'm close to this. Something's not right here. I needed to get home. To Alice. Is she even real? What the hell was that interview? Some kind of she joke. She may not even be real. Initiation? I never wrote a book called Initiation. This felt like a bad dream. Could make a good horror story. Oh, God, I'm gonna fucking code. Hey! I think I've been locked in! Anybody! Fuck. Now I have to find the code myself. Great. I was a mess. I'd never heard of this talk show or Wait, Mr. Door it? before. None of Casper it felt right. Darling. Was I losing my mind? So where's this code? Gods of Asgard. That name sounded familiar. Can't see anything. It's so dark. What's that? Is that me? Okay, that was me. So I can't go that way. Oh wait, the code's going back, like backstage maybe. It's really dark. I don't like it. I actually don't know where I'm going. Hmm. Hell is the code? Do I have a map? I have nothing. Um. Do I have to just guess the code or something? I mean, it's only a three digit code. Is that the code? Six six five. They're the only numbers I've seen. Is that is that the code? That that is the only numbers I have seen throughout this place. I swear to God, if it is, I'm gonna kill myself. It better not be. Pain, misery, despair. I was searching for ages and it was literally on the wall in my face. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. What was that? A message? Oh, impossible to say. How am I now? There was something in the studio with me. I had to get out. What is it? I want to know what it is. This is the ritual to reach war. Waking up from the nightmare, oh. I felt like a drowning man gasping for air. This place felt familiar. A ghost of a memory surfaced about writing here for countless days. I'm in the room where I did all the typewriting, where I wrote the story. Ew. A plot board for mapping out a story. On the index cards, the night, night just happened to me. A 
best summary of the story so far. But other notes as well. Warnings. I had written them. I couldn't remember what it all meant. The name Scratch filled me with dread. I could trust these words. I had to act on them. You must write to escape. Okay. So I've got to write. Alex Casey, Sam Wake, Sam Lake, sorry. In the film series. And of course we have Alan Wake here. Best coming writer, the books, the films are based on. Let's do this! Uh. Looks like that, so. Oh, I thought I can just leave. So I've got to go back in. Face. Back in I go then. Welcome back to the show. So, Alan, as the uh, creator of the character, how do you feel about this? Sorry, what? <laughs> I know it can be an awkward question to the man sitting right next to you, but I mean, how do you feel about him in the role of Casey? Does he look the part to you? Uh... Oh, God. He looks exactly like I always imagined Casey to be. It's uncanny. Thank you. That means so much to me. I'm a huge fan of your books. So, uh, what's the problem, Alan? Because on more than one occasion, you voiced your reservations about the adaptations. Uh, it's not that. They're their own thing. They've gone with choices that are different from mine. I. I I feel protective about my stories and these adaptations. I, I don't know. I, I guess I just wish I could have been more involved in making them. Well, in that case, you won't have seen this either. We have a clip from the new film, Murder Case Case. Should we roll it or do you want to say something first, Sam? Nah, just roll it. This city was an old scar that refused to heal. The rain made it fester. It needed the sun, but there was only the night. I was tired. Insomnia covered me like a plastic film. I was watching the world through a rain-slick window, my own reflection haunting the view. I was trying to track down a missing writer. My only clue was a table lamp shaped like an angel. The only thing to shed light on this sordid mystery. Ah. That's great. Murder case, Casey. Great job, Sam. Very exciting and very meta. I'm looking forward to seeing more. Wait, stop. What was that about a writer? About a lamp? I'm back here again. Great. So I'm just doing loops to like uncover something. So is something gonna be different now? So if I go down here, is this gonna open? Nope. 
This is closed now. Okay, ending the. It's no, it won't be the same one again, right? Wait, wrong room. Hang on. I've lost still. That is. Same code. That's oh, not. Code has changed. So why is this cycling through? So there's got to be another code somewhere then. Ew. Um, I don't know where that code would be. Anything unlocked over here? No? Okay. The only thing that's changed is the numbers cycling through, so maybe it's like a different. I tried all the layouts though, what number it could be. Oh, you're right. You're right. Oh, wait, five, six, five? Is that what it's saying? Oh, that's what it was saying. Ah, oh, that's why it was cycling through like that. Ew. My bad. She went in there last time. She went on here. Cut. Hey. Okay. Where did the door go? So, will this open now? Ah, it opens. Hello? Do I hear someone? Oh! Hello, janitor. Hi. Ah, there you are, Tom. Oh, not so much evil that not a bit of good as well. Not one without the other. <laughs> good to see you. Hey, I, I can't seem to find my way out of here. Can you point me to the exit? <laughs> of course, Tom. Mr. The work will instruct its maker. I was gonna get something from the basement for you, but... You can get it yourself now. Uh, the more cooks, the worse the soup. <laughs> what? What do you want me to get from the basement? A and my name's Alan, not Tom. Yeah, yeah, but I got a bag of a man's. A man, but a man with a tool makes two, Tom. Egane. <laughs> and a man with a tool can build his own exit. It's in a soup box. In the basement where you left it. <laughs> Safe as in the Lord's purse. Here's the key. He's very weird, this guy is. Thank you. Wait, do you know how I can escape? Have we met before? Are you trapped in the dark place too? You remember Ahti, the janitor. You can't be lost if you don't worry about where you are headed. So, don't worry, Tom. The sun will shine even into a heap of twigs. 
Just remember to turn on the lights. It won't take long when you get to work. Okay. The basement it is then. Where is the basement actually? Is it down here? Wait. Basement. Oh. Here it is. And look. So, in a shoebox, he said. Okay. Ah, I got a map. So I'm looking for a shoebox. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on a minute. How am I back here? Wait, what? How am I in here now? I was just in the basement, wasn't I? I couldn't leave. This wasn't the way out. How am I back here now? I don't understand how I just got back here. Oh, that's the... Oh, okay, that's the boardroom. Duh. I thought I was actually back there, like... Stuck. Oh, the a shoebox. Was this what the janitor had left for me? Oh, here it is. The lamp felt significant. A tool for bringing light to the darkness. What, so that? I felt a magnetic pull between the lamp and the light overhead. Whoa! Whoa, that's cool. Lamp. The whole room changed. Like something in a dream. Well, and then I can put it back. Way forward. The lamp was humming. That's the sick. glowed. It held the light now. Oh, I really like that. Oh, I like that a lot. I felt another surge from the lamp. So I can like. The lamp oh my god, this is class. So I can like build my own room. exit. I mean, that's literally what the guy said. From the darkness. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that is actually quite. That's actually quite good. That was really cool.
Oh, I really like that, how, like, you've got to, like, trap the light and, like, build your own... Yeah. I like that a lot. Oh, so I've got to, like... Oh, that's what I gotta do. Okay. Okay, guys, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you like and subscribe. We're gonna end this chapter here. We're gonna get on to another chapter straight away. Oh, quick save. There we go. Sorted. Cool. Okay, guys, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you like and subscribe. And I'll cut you guys in the next video. See ya.